After 28 years, Brad Jerbick has retired as our city attorney. Well, another veteran attorney is going to take over that top legal office. And Brad himself, along with the unanimous city council, say Brian Scott is the perfect selection. It looked like there was a celebrity in the house outside Las Vegas City Council Chambers June 17th. Maybe not a celebrity, but certainly someone worth celebrating. Just moments before this photo op with Brian Scott, he had officially been voted in as the city attorney for the city of Las Vegas. Citing his 29 years as an attorney, 24 of those years with the city of Las Vegas, and the time spent as the senior assistant city attorney, Mayor Carolyn Goodman said his work, often done outside the spotlight, and his work ethic, seen by all, all the time, makes him the perfect attorney to take over for retiring Brad Jerbick. So I just in speaking for everybody in the city that has no idea what you've been doing, um, really uh, the gratitude is so enormous. Uh, the the um, pride of, of what you've done for this city. Jerbick, who filled the top attorney role for 28 years for the city, took time during his final presentation before the council to say Brian Scott is the perfect person to carry on. And first of all, I want to congratulate Brian Scott. I really can't think of a better person to become your city attorney. He has been with the city for 24 years. Uh, he served as our assistant city attorney for 20 years. Uh, Brian has always been there in the clutch between night meetings, day meetings, uh, anything Brian can do, he's always volunteered to do it. And, and I really uh, congratulate you on such an excellent choice. I really cannot think of a better person. Shortly after that statement, it was made official. The motion carries. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. We managed to coax him away from friends and family photos long enough to ask him how he feels about his new position. He explained he is not the first attorney for the city, but he is the first in one respect. You know, it really means a lot. It's overwhelming to me, first of all, to have the council's unanimous consideration and their vote to be ratified as a city attorney, but it's also to be the first African-American city attorney in the 23 att uh, city attorneys in the city's 119 year history. That's tremendous. And I, when I, the city clerk gave me that information, I was very surprised to see that I was the 23rd and the first. He went on to tell us this is not the first of his firsts. I've been the uh, first African-American president of the State Bar of Nevada in 2016-17, the first African-American president of the Clark County Bar Association in 2005, first African-American president of the Clark County uh, Law Foundation in 2006, and then president of the National Bar Association Las Vegas chapter in 1996 through 99. So I've been really doing a lot of community service work and I really um, thank, want to thank Mr. Jerbic for allowing me during the time that I've been here to, com to continue my community service work. So that's been a really tremendous help to me. As he told us and told the city council, he may have more than two decades in with the city already, but he isn't planning to go anywhere anytime soon. As I have done for the past 24 years, I promise this council and my city that I will continue to do my very best to guide the city and you lawfully with integrity and will always do what's in the best interest of the city of Las Vegas. Again, I thank you for this tremendous honor. Wow. A little more history on Brian Scott. He's lived in Las Vegas since he was three years old. He's been an attorney for 29 years, most of those years here in the city of Las Vegas. He graduated from UNLV and got his law degree from Lewis and Clark Law School in Portland, Oregon. Congratulations to Brian Scott, and we bid a very fond farewell to Brad Jerbic.